Well, hi there, guys. This is Faster Than Yours, episode 10. Sim City, if you remember last time, we built a uh, coal mine. We're doing exports here at the Trade Depot, and we got our cruise ship docked. Now, I haven't seen a cruise ship go by. Oh, here comes one. Please stop. <laughs> I haven't seen one actually dock, so I don't know if that sort of thing even happens. It's got some nice little animations with it. That's pretty slick, all the people going in and out. Let's see. Waiting on the ferry. Alright, well, maybe now we'll have... Uh, have some ferries come through and people will get going. Now I was talking about doing a possibility of an airport the last time around and I think in order to be able to do this I am going to have to bulldoze all kinds of stuff. So um, I am going to pause the game so that things don't start rebuilding on me we are just going to tear down some stuff and I'm going to see if I can get away with building an airport yep goodbye and that's okay and that's okay and this should be okay Bulldoze that road too. Now we go into our mass transit system and the planes and we choose the airport and this is what we get. Now I'm going to see if I cannot rebuild the road right there at the bottom. I don't like that and then I can move the industry zones down. So that's our airport. Now let's bulldoze this road and I do not want to bulldoze the entire garbage dump. No. Edit. Bulldoze. Close. Close. How do I get rid of them? I don't need them there. I want them to go away. I do not know. Maybe if I just tear up the road, they'll go away. Alright. Well, no, 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 no. I don't want to build another garbage dump. Turn them back on. Okay, and then let's try bulldozing the road. No, 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 can't do that. Yes, he wants me to take the whole thing out. Maybe, maybe I can do this. And then, where's my road? Medium, dense, high density street. Bring it over here. section right there. Okay. Now rezone everything that's not zoned currently into industrial area. And then hopefully maybe factories will build. I don't know how this works with this airport. This is really weird to me. So not whole thing industrial. Am I missing any spots? Yeah, I could go there. Okay, now let's edit the airport. Let's see if there's any upgrades available. As I understand it, you can add an extra runway. 
increase the flights, but we don't have a problem with flights right now. And then you can add a passenger terminal. Increase your airport's capacity from rinky dink connections to something more respectable. Now where would you build this? Eighty five hundred dollars. Heck yeah, let's do that. And then what's this? Cargo, yeah, yeah, we want to ship stuff. Okay. Carrying passengers and cargo. Always got to put the sign out. Let's see, I think we'll put the sign right there. That works. What is this? Yeah, why not? Two runways, spend all the money. Let's hit play. Maybe it'll open and we'll get some planes and hopefully some industrial people will start building back up here. Yes, thank goodness. <sighs> Still having the issue with not enough workers. And I just don't really feel like rezoning any of these areas. I mean, I guess I could rezone this commercial area here in the residential, but I don't know if that's going to do me any good. I mean, here's one possibility, but let's see. Where's the entrance to this building? If I bulldoze this road, what's going to happen? Um, that's just something we're going to have to deal with. <laughs> but I can't believe that uh, I'm almost to, you know, 100,000 people. Look at this, 96,000. I mean, we just upgraded. <laughs> we just upgraded here, 292,000 residents. That's enormous. I need like more vertical space if I'm going to do something like that. People are protesting low land values. Okay, so now we were talking about upgrading the medium density street. And that's going to cause a problem because this is my police precinct. Oh, let me see what this little thing says. More parks. I understand where we would need more parks at. More parks. They've got parks everywhere. Well, I guess I could put one here. Parks back here on these residential zones. Is this commercial or residential? Commercial. Resi commercial, residential. I mean, I got residential. I think. Let's look at our maps here. I think what I want to do is tear up. want to replace no see that doesn't work I mean these are big buildings gonna think about this because I want to get this avenue connected over here I mean I suppose I could just demolish all of this and run my medium density uh, not the medium density the uh, medium density avenue from here this way yeah, you know what? Pause. All right. What's what's on this street? Big box. Credit union. I mean, there's no like thing 
things is there? What is this? No, it looks like city services. That's what I'm really concerned with. Alright. So, two things are going to happen. I'm going to bulldoze this street from here back to here. Yeah. And we'll do this. And worry about zoning in just a minute. Let's do some more bulldozing. And then we're going to take this street. Here, and then this street. Oh, my map's not moving. There we go. To here, tall tree row. What is tall tree row? Yeah, of course I want to bulldoze that. It's just a park. <laughs> that was confusing. Now I want to take my medium density street. And I guess I'm stopping here. <laughs> so I have to bulldoze that park right there. Yes, I'll do it. Medium density avenue. Sorry, I meant to say avenue a minute ago. Now we want to come to here. And I'm going to have to go like this and make some unhappy people. Look at how. Is that really crooked like that? Man, that is crooked. <laughs> wow. Okay. Now, zoning. I want to make sure we get our commercial people back and happy. We're building bigger buildings, bigger stores. So I'm just holding down control while I'm doing this because I just want to make sure that it is covering those open areas. And then one thing else I want to do is, I think I can get that building, because that is the large fire station, which I hope is over here, and not on, oh no. You know what, we'll do that one last. Are you connected there as well? How are you connected? Oh, darn it. Okay, well, we're at least going to do this road. And then when I get some more money, if I remind myself, I'm going to come back and bulldoze the fire station and move it to, like, here. And then residential will have this whole big square. Now I want to do that. How can I be... Need to edit the fire station because I have to get rid of the the one fire truck. Hmm. Yeah, 
yeah, I just might have to wait on this. I don't know if I can do that, because... <sighs> Let me look at the zones again. Alright, I can definitely do here. Medium skate park gone. Alright, now let's put back in the residential zones again, holding control, just trying to make sure that everything gets covered like it's supposed to. And then here, and here, and here. Alright, so that's all our commercial coverage. Oh, residential here, 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 and here, and here. So I think what I am going to do though is bulldoze this road. Get out of the way. And then that will give the opportunity for larger residential building right here behind the school. Alright, commercial. Now, two things that you need to check since we knocked down this large road is I need to check my school coverage and make sure that my residential areas are still covered. Because uh, we did bulldoze some roads, so we need to make sure they're happy. And is that yellow? What is this? Oh, it's just a glitch. All right, and then we need to check the mass transit system and make sure that my bus stops are still in place because we still want people coming and buying things, right? Fifty-eight minute average wait. Well, we're working on that because we're gonna do eventually upgrade this medium density avenue to um, to the one with the... is this the trolley? No, we want to do the high density streetcar. So that'll be great. Alright, well let's hit play and see the destruction unfold before me as the population of my city just dropped 20,000. So, but it should go back up. I'm losing money. And that's okay. Um, I did see here that it looks like we have an upgrade available. So, that's great. Um, I want to hold off on that for just a moment because I want to focus on what we just did here. And you can see we're already getting some construction. I'm going to bump it up to cheetah speed. See these buildings are getting larger. You know, that's commercial. There's another residential, another large residential. Surprised we don't have a large residential. Oh, parks. I did bulldoze some parks. That will lower the land value. That's something that uh, you know. Overall, you got to be real, real careful with. Um, I think we want to get some larger parks in, like here. Yeah. And then, want to go ahead and put in. Does this plaza have a big circle? No. I'll go ahead and put in put in this large plaza. Yeah, look at that. Start doing new cons yeah, see? This is what's happening. This is what we were going for. Now my population's still dropping and that's okay. I've still got enough money to cover myself for a little while. Um I'm going to be a little worried if my population starts dropping any more than that. But, you know, if we come back over here and look, you know, we've got some some really nice buildings going on here. You know, these are commercial. It's another large residential structure. 
unlocked the international airport. Municipal airport. Where is that in here? Maybe. Tourism. Three hundred and seventy seven tours per day. Well, that's cool. Making four thousand dollars a day from coal. That's not bad. I mean, I'll take it. It's four thousand dollars we weren't making. Let's check the airport. Six point three carts of freight, zero tourists waiting to depart. Tourist arrivals today, 120 tourists waiting. So, you know, we put in our two uh, two runways there and it um, seems to be... Oh, look, there's a plane. Oh, a plane just landed. I was hoping we'd see that. That's cool. And two just took off. So we're doing something, right? And let's check our ferry terminal. Currently waiting. Resident riders, tourist riders. Average wait, 66 minutes. Well, I can't put in another. Passenger ferry. 116 minute average wait. That's not good. We got more tourists than we have. Uh, I see you can only do. I mean, it's just it. You only get one and one, not two and two. All right, so you can see my population's coming back up, up to seventy-five thousand again. I don't want to go spending a lot of money just at the moment because we have, you know, we have quite a lot of construction going on. We should be gaining back some money here shortly. All right, that's a nice residential building. This is going to be a nice residential building. I, I mean, I knew that upgrading this avenue was going to be the way to go. So, you know what, guys, and um, if you've got any other suggestions, please put them in the comments. It is helpful. I do listen to them. I, I've been communicating back and forth with a few of you. Oh, what is this guy here? Helicopter. News helicopter. Can I really see the news helicopter? Could oh, he's following the fire at the building here. Which my guys are all over. Yep, my firefighters are doing it. No patience waiting. So anyway, like I was saying, put some comments in, suggestions. I do appreciate the uh, communications. It does help. Uh, I have I have been recently learning a few new techniques. Uh, we're still doing okay there, and we're still doing okay on water. And power is. Let's check power. Check that right here. Oh, we're getting close. Next time, I think what we're going to do is upgrade our reactor have the opportunity to put in a, a um, if you look here in the options have the opportunity to put in another geothermal reactor um, can't do this until we have the University of Science and we complete a research project so I at least got to do something that'll make another 200 megawatts for us but anyway like I was saying comments likes please subscribe and share with your friends follow me on Twitter oh look the fairy came that's awesome so I guess that's gonna be the end of the episode for today so until next time you guys have a good one bye